The family of an inmate at Butner Prison reaches out to CBS 17, saying they had no idea he died from COVID-19 back in April. CBS 17's Colleen Quigley is outside Butner Prison with the latest. Colleen. Fabian Tinsley's family tells me they only found out about his death yesterday after finding our own news report. They want to know why the prison never notified them about his passing. 67-year-old Fabian Tinsley was the fifth inmate at Butner Prison to die from COVID-19 back in April. Even when he's my uncle, I look at him as my father. But his family says they didn't learn about his death until this month. I, I couldn't even just say my last goodbyes. I don't even know where he at. Um, like, that's all. My, my father didn't have nobody else on that side. Fabian's niece, Regina, and his brother, Reginald, say they hadn't seen Fabian since his arrest in Washington, D.C. several years ago. Regina says they tried to get in contact with him after his transfer to Butner in 2018. That's not the first time we reached out to Butner to try to get some information on him or anything. And I called up there and they had told us he was not, he was they no had way they nowhere can... in there that they, 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 he was never there, like basically he was never there and they don't know who he is. Regina says frustrated, her sister started searching online. A fifth inmate at a federal prison near Butner has died. And came across our news report from April 17th, stating that Fabian died. Okay. I saw crying. Regina and Reginald say they still haven't received any information from the prison about Fabian's remains. We don't know where his body's located, what they did with him. And they didn't know about We didn't know, they didn't notify his family. Which they did have some type of contact and paperwork on him and his family. Mm -hmm. So they could have contacted us. I searched the Federal Bureau of Prison Database and the only information listed is that Fabian is deceased. I want to know what they did with his body. Mm -hmm. I would like to remove him and have him with his mom. His family says they weren't able to visit him in prison, so now they want to bury him with his family in D.C. I did reach out to the Federal Bureau of Prisons, which oversees the facility here at Butner. I wanted to know if and when someone reached out to Fabian Tinsley's family. I also wanted to learn more about the process of notifying the family of an inmate who's passed away. I haven't heard back from them, but as soon as I do, we'll update this report. Reporting in Butner, Colleen Quigley, CBS 17 News.